You have livestock that has reached maturity, apparently. Okay. Guess, uh, guess we can go back to the ranch. Welcome back, everyone. Hello. Welcome back to some more Tales of Arise. I forget what part we're on to now. I think it might be 19. It's 19 or 20. We just arrived in the capital of this uh, third realm. Vicent, I think it's called. And as you can see, things are looking pretty nice here. Uh, we haven't really explored too much yet, so that's what we're going to do uh, very soon. We have a couple of uh, things to check in on. We've basically been told to explore the city, so that's what we're going to do. But my god. I I mean, I think it's a no-brainer which, which realm I'd rather live in out of the three so far. Even if the snow is nice and, and uh, you know, Cisladen was very pretty. I, I think this is... I think this is more my speed. Even, I mean, even the Renans seem pretty nice here, so far at least. I mean, I have my suspicions. But, um, let's chat to this little girl. You want to know what I'm doing? You're obviously tending to the flowers. Or the, or the trees. They're not very big trees. If, I don't get, uh, if they don't get tender loving care, then the flowers Lord Dolahim loves so much will never grow here. You're surprised. This is a highly respectable occupation here, you know. Huh. Well, yeah, this Lord Dohalim seems like a pretty decent chap. But is it all just a just a, a charade? Eh? Or is it charade? Charade? I suppose if you want to be posh, you can call it a charade. I'm not posh, so I don't know why I said it that way. Anyway, uh, the capital of Vicent is paradise to all. Are you okay, mister? I'll call someone over right away. Now, I'm looking- I'm pretty good. I'm, I'm loving this new look for the armor we've got. One thing I did do, actually, off-screen, I forgot to mention, was I went and got a few more of those granite fangs that we needed for the side quest for that chap over there. So, you know what? Actually, before we go check on the wrench, let's uh, hand it in. Hey. I brought you those zoogle fangs. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Thank you very much, kind sir. Now I have enough to make more utensils. And apparently, this is kind of like a... Uh, alluding to a real thing. Silver would react to arsenic in real life, which is why they made cutlery out of silver back in the day. Uh, which is kind of great. I didn't know that. Or if I did know that, I've totally forgot. So thank you in the comments for letting me know. A little bit of a history lesson. Wow. Oh, you're the one who makes them, huh? Mind if I watch what you, uh, watch you do that sometime? If you're okay with an audience, that is. <laughs> Of course, please feel free to visit me whenever you have a moment to spare and watch me fork. And spoon. And knife. I'd love if you could make, uh, may maybe also turn some of those tusks into we- Hey! <laughs> I knew it. I knew Alfred was- had some sort of ulterior motive. I, I think we're going to head out now. <laughs> Thank you for your gen generosity. And we get, yep, good bit of money. Uh, and that's one thing I need to do, actually, is, um... I've not really you been need checking to stop the this fixation with weapons. Oh. But you're the same way about food. Are you planning to stop that? <sighs> Good point. Touche. Touche. I'll go check on my livestock in a minute game. I'll I'll do that. Uh, I haven't really been checking the merchants uh, wares in terms of armor. So we'll go do that in a minute as well. After I sip my beverage. Uh yeah. So you know what? Let's go in fact, we can probably fast travel to the, uh, to the ranch. For some reason, there's no fast travel point here, though, which is weird. There must... Oh, I think there's one in the inn, actually. But yeah, uh, I'm guessing there's going to be one if we explore the city a little bit. But we're going to head back to the Trasilda Highway. In fact, we're just going to go straight to the ranch. And check on our livestock for the first time. Oh, by the way, Zephyr's dead, in case you'd forgotten. Thanks, game. We've reached our destination. Look at this ranch, man. This is the life. Ugh. Oh, we got... Wait, why are these... Why do you not have big ears? Why are you boring normal-ass pigs? I want a refund. I want a refund, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the following livestock has reached maturity. Cow, pig, and chicken. Do you remember Cow and Chicken? That was a weird, weird cartoon. 
Ooh, a trophy. Oh, I do love me some trophies. And we just got a, a crap ton of, of meat. All right, so I guess we just do the same then. We just do the same. And I, I'm, I'm, again, I'm, I'm not in any rush. I'm not going to feed them anything special. They've got to earn that crap. All right. So there we go. We've still got all of our uh, dogs and cats guarding the place. I don't know when they're going to have to deal with, you know, Zoogle attacks. But uh, that's fine. Okay, then. Right. Also, I I may have uh, noticed another side quest out here. So I just want to quickly go check what it is. Hopefully we won't run into any more blooming random ass dragons in in regular fights. I mean, it's kind of cool that that can happen, but it's scary. It's very Let's scary. See what's going on around here? Yeah, there might be someone who could use our help. Uh, apparently, this chap. Hmm. Royal Guard. I understand your concern, sir, but we've got our hands full with other matters. We'll try to take care of it as soon as we can get to it. We appreciate your patience. Hey! As soon as you can, I can't afford to wait. Don't you understand? Everybody's going to be in deep trouble if you don't get on this. Is it? Let me. Let me guess. Let me guess. Is it? Is it a Zoogle problem? What's wrong? Sounds like you're de uh, we're dealing with a serious situation here. Hmm? Hmm? You could say that. My farming equipment's all ruined. Band of Zoogles are behind it. The pesky varmints. They're using astral, uh, earth astral energy, or whatever you call it, and making the metal on my equipment rust up. Oh, no. Why is this happening? I, I don't know why they've taken a grievance with your farming equipment. Huh? I mean... That's obviously what he was asking them to do. These ones are untamed. Even the Renans are helpless to do. Really? Even Renans can't take care of them? Are you sure? Damn it. Then again, I suppose these Renans, if they're not busy being dicks to the to the populace, maybe they've gone soft. Uh, the yield of my feet, the yield of my field, is going to be worse than or than awful. Like, really awful. Manancia might be doing well these days, but that's down to farmers like me who help maintain our food supplies. I guess. I guess. I can definitely understand why this is a big problem. But I mean, out, my ranch is doing fine, so, you know, I don't really care. <laughs> <sighs> Things get pretty miserable when you go hungry. Yeah, ask Xion. I'm sure there are plenty of uh, people in this realm remember what it's like. Uh, all too well. I don't have to see. Uh, I don't want to have to see them suffer through that again. We will lend a hand. Got it. Uh, we'll take care of the Zoogles. What the? I'm a literal lifesaver. Just hate that the guard and armored soldiers aren't handing it like they should. I mean, uh, they've. Yeah. I don't know what they've got, got. What's kept them so busy? But they seem decent enough, so I'm sure they would do if they could. We'll fix this. Wait here and we'll get rid of those Zoogles. Getting rusty. Let's hope uh, Alphans armor doesn't get rusty because it looks lovely. Do Zoogles just go after anything that looks remotely like farm equipment? It's me. Let's just focus on ensuring they don't make matters any worse. By the way, why do you keep looking over yourself? <laughs> huh? Oh, no reason. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Wait, what? He's admiring himself because he he knows he looks absolutely fucking sick. That's why he's doing it. Also, oh, can I not get any more milk from the cows today? Ah well. Excuse me. You should be killing zoogles, not just strutting about like you're in the place, which you do. But still. Uh, right. Where's this? Um, where's this quest wanted me to go? Over here, I suppose. Defeat, oh, eight earthen mass near the field. Well, again, if it's going to be quests like that where I don't really need to show it off because we've seen these enemies before, I might not do them on screen. But please do let me know if you still want to see them, even if it's, again, it's going to be stuff that you've seen a million times before. Hmm. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. Let, let me know in the chat, but I'm not going to do that just yet. We will head back to town. Uh, 
And yeah, th there isn't actually, like, a fast travel point here, so we'll have to go to the inn. Oh, actually, before I do... Oh, there's merchants in here, though. I can check the merchants in here. I just want to see if there is any new armor that we can equip. Oh, Zephyr's dead. Ugh, we finally made it. Shocker. Hello, have you got any armor? Oh, you do. Hey, Zoogle shell dress, shell armor. It's actually uh, not too shabby for Alfin and uh, and Shion. Okay. Purchase and equip. Nice. So yeah, I'd completely forgot to check for armor. But it's okay. Should I buy some apple gels? Again, they're actually kind of expensive. Oh, but they are very useful in a pinch. I'll, I'll buy four. Okay. Come back soon. Will do. Also, I think um, off screen, yeah, Rinwell got to level 18, but I haven't really spent anyone's SP or anything like that, so... I suppose we'll quickly have a check. Um... Oh, you know what? Yeah, we'll get Severing Wind, because um, that will give us an extra 10 defense bonus. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. And... Not sure. Increased counterattack damage. Boost strike damage. I just really don't know what to go for first with anyone, really. Um, I might just prioritize trying to get the bonuses. So... Increased max art gauge. Actually, you know what, Shion? You know what? I'm going to give you that. There you go. Uh, Rinwell. Ooh, we'll say... Oh, we need... We need Seriously, we need six more SP for that. Reduced art casting time during combos. I think we will we'll definitely go for that. Get a bit more defense. And uh, that's that sounds like a plan. Law doesn't have much SP right now, so... You shit out of luck. Mage is my name! I'm gonna say that every time, so I'm sorry if it annoys people. Do you sense one of your friends, Hoodle? I guess there's an owl to find somewhere as well. Right, let's start, let's start uh, chatting. Chatting to the townsfolk. Hey, Guardsman, shouldn't you be working? I don't know what it's like uh, in the realm you come from, but here in Manancia, everything's peaceful. There's zero chance of anything bad happening. Well, now that you've said that... Well, yeah, thanks to the Lord, life is nice for all of us. Yeah, see? It's more than just us anyway. There's also the Guardsman. Nothing's gonna break if I slack off. Nonetheless, the reason this city is so peaceful is because you Renan soldiers are around. All the younger kids idolize you. This is so different from everywhere else we've been so far. You've got a silver tongue, Mr. Fine. I'll make this drink my last. Drinking on the job. And yes, I just took a sip of my tea to, to really hammer home that fact. This is technically my job. I'm drinking on the job. Deal with it. One, two, three, four. Oh, I'm missing one. Wait, why would you need... You talk about this. You talk about the wheels. Why would you need more than four wheels? I don't know. Oh, oh, and yes, we got the fast travel point. Where is this owl? I can hear it. Is it going to be in the tree? Where is it? It's very close by. I, c I can. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's got a Halo! Which is funny, I've just been playing the new Halo. It's very good. Hey, a Ring of Holy Light. It also doubles as decent neck support when reading books in bed. <laughs> Such a random description. Thanks. I'll bear that in mind. I really Look, should read more, though. One of your buddies. Yay. Hey, ma'am, we're almost out of liquor. 
Goodness gracious, we're still getting customers. Go buy some more for me, quick. You're a real slave driver sometimes, ma'am. Uh, oh, we've got a cutscene. <laughs> Eager guide. I take it you folks are all travelers. It's so wonderful to have you all here. Oh, thank you. I guess. You really don't bat an eye at us all being together, do you? Even though we have uh, Renan with us. Well, obviously not. Renan's around these parts are actually kind of okay. <laughs> Which is going to make it weird if, if this lord is a genuinely decent person and we still have to kill him. But I'm sure that won't be the case. I suppose it might not be a common sight elsewhere in Dana, but here in Vicent, it's part of everyday life. Hey, if we want to visit the palace, do we keep going this way? Sure. That's exactly right. Although if you ask me, the training grounds might be more up your alley, since you all appear to be uh, of that persuasion. We are we are absolutely badasses, yes. Training grounds, you say? Is that code for some kind of arena where you make complete strangers fight and kill one another for sports? <laughs> no, absolutely not. It's nothing terrible like that. The training grounds are what they sound like. It's true that years ago it used to be a really gruesome place where slaves had to fight each other, as well as vicious zoogles. But when our current lord, Lord Dohalim, came to power, one of the very first things he did was put a stop to such awful spectacle. Hmm. You're telling me a Renan lord did that? Yeah, Shion doesn't seem convinced. The place was then refurnished and reopened as a proper palace, uh, p palace, pa a place to train, like it's known for these days. <laughs> It's mainly designed to be used by the Elder Manancia Guard, but it's open to anyone who wishes to use its facilities. Hmm? Anyone? Even Danans? Sure. The arena is far too punishing for me, but if you're looking to hone your skills... <gasps> is there an arena in this game? Is there a battle? Oh. There might be, you know. Training grounds for all. And that's actually a quest, is it? Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll make that a priority. That does sound good, though. I do, I do love a good battle arena in, a, in an RPG. Hmm. I remember Star Ocean Three had a really good one. Uh, what are your plans for dinner tonight? Oh, okay. This place is so pretty. Got another side quest. Hello. Okay. Frontier man, I gather you guys came here along the highway, yeah? You didn't happen to run into that thing along the way, did you? What thing? Talking about a huge zoogle that flies around the skies, occasionally dropping down to attack both people and zoogles alike. Yeah, we did come across it, mate. It scared the living piss out of me. And it, it beat the living piss out of me, too. That's something you don't meet every day. The guy's really something. Even the uniforms here have a hard time dealing with it. I've even tried putting a bounty on it to sweeten the pot, you'd say, but everyone's just about given up on it. We'll see what we can do, but even though it was it was not that high a level, I I think we could possibly do it, but the AI characters I mean, I I suck at avoiding attacks, but they they were not dealing with it at all. Got it. We'll handle it. I'm sure we'll find a way to get rid of it. Hmm? Yeah, it's called grinding. Really think you have what it takes? I mean, you all look capable, don't get me wrong, but we got this, don't worry. As a matter of fact, we got someone here who can practically shoot down flying zoogles with her eyes closed. Just great. <laughs> you mean Shion. I don't think she's going to appreciate you volunteering her for this. Well, if you think you can handle it, that'd be great. Yep. Normally it'll leave you alone, but if it sees a fight break out, that's when it swoops in. Yeah, we gotta be careful about that, because... Oof. Well... Yeah, we gotta fight other zoogles. It is a pain in the ass, but clever... A clever pain in the ass. We'll have to go hunt it. You better have that bounty ready by the time we get back. All right. I'm a man of my word. I'm a man of my word. Claiming a bounty. I don't like bounties. The chocolate, I mean. I don't like coconut. Uh, I will not make that a priority. Because we ain't doing that just yet. I absolutely do not. What are you going to use the prize money for? What else? Eating until my stomach bursts. That sounds right up Shion's alley. Sure does. Sure does. Right, so we still got a lot to explore. We got another side quest coming up. Um and a point of interest, the city of coexistence. Uh I don't know if we're gonna find any items to pick up in the city. Although we did find one, didn't we already? I think so. 
begin with, there is lockdown at the moment. Um, there's no going through it. Not like anyone wants to go through anyway. The room it leads to is... is dangerous. Oh, what are these kids up to? Did all those people move here? Dad says that people used to have to carry lots of heavy and dangerous stuff. I don't know if I believe that. I can't imagine that kind of stuff ever happening here. Oh, it did. It did, and it sucked. Oh, yep, yeah, there is. There are items. More pork. Just, just, just meat. Meat galore. Huh? I think someone's calling out for us. They could have something they need from us. Another dude just chilling on. What is? Oh wait, this isn't the same guy, is it? That we encountered earlier? <sighs> it is, I think. <laughs> What's wrong? It is, I'm sure it is. You okay? Yeah, it is the food. Yeah, it's the food guy. Yes. Uh, why, hello there, Blazing Sword. I haven't seen you since we were in Cislodia. Needless to say, I'm hungry. <sighs> Again? Lord, give this man some of those mushrooms you just picked. No, no potatoes this time. Ah, you never learn anything, do you? Just what sort of wretched fungus are you trying to throw, uh, stuff down my throat? I don't, I don't know, I think they're pretty good. Yeah, mushrooms are great, dude. How? I wish I shared your unfounded courage, my boy. Anyway, there's besides the point. I'm here in Vicent on important business. What is it? What recipe do you want? <laughs> Through careful investigating, uh, investigation and some sneaking around, I've acquired a top secret recipe from none other than the palace itself. However, I'm short on ingredients. Could I ask you all to procure what I need once more? Huh? Yeah, sneaking around? Before I answer that, tell me, do you enjoy meat? I- I do. I'm a carnivore. Uh, well, actually, technically, that's not true, is it? What's the one where you eat both? Carnivore, herbivore, omnivore. I'm an omnivore. I think that's right. <laughs> The recipe I pilfered is none other than beef stew. First rate dish that's all about its meat. Hey. Y wait, you're saying a beef stew is all about the meat? Whoa. Did you steal the recipe? Is, is, that, is that what you're saying? So what if I did? Who cares? Now, what do you say? Will you gather what I need or not? Alfin, I'm pretty sure this guy's breaking the law. Breaking? He's not breaking you. What are you, what are you talking about? Wait, oh, you mean the law, not your name. Oh. He uncovered his recipe from the palace. I don't think that's quite makes him a criminal. <laughs> Precisely. I simply took what I learned from those snake eyes I saw in Cislodia and put it to use in the name of fine cuisine. Am I really hearing this? What I need is meat and potatoes. And mushrooms. And tomatoes. So you refused the mushrooms that we were trying to give you to then ask for mushrooms. Okay. We have what you need already, pal. Right. Nice work. In that case, I need you to follow this recipe here and cook me a beef stew. Are you making me cook again? <laughs> Can't wait to see how this turns out, Alvin. I must admit, I'm quite hungry. <sighs> I'm not the biggest fan of stew, though. Especially beef stew. I don't- I don't know why, it's just... I could eat it, it's fine, but... I would never choose to eat right. it. But then again, I'm a very picky eater, as many of you know. Uh, see, so here I have to let it simmer for five hours. Oh yeah, throw that- throw that thing in the- in the old, uh, slow cooker. No way. That's a long ass time. That beef would have tasted perfectly fine if we just grilled it up real quick. I don't believe this. <laughs> if that's how you're going to act, boy, then you can forget about having any. Five hours later. Oh, Great. damn. It's actually nighttime. Very nice. Look at that beautiful dish. It smells just as divine, too. Now let's see how it tastes. What? Whoa. This, this is ab exquisite. Oh, shocker. Alphans a really bloody good cook. I'm in heaven. Truly, this is a golden age of cooking we live in. I guess... That doesn't really tell us anything about how it actually tastes. I mean, pretty good is the reaction. It was pretty dramatic. Whoa. Why don't you try some, Law? Yeah! I, I think he... I think he's up for that. Whoa. Holy crap! 
This meat is so tender, I feel like it's going to melt right in my mouth. Ooh, that actually did make my mouth water a little bit just then. And the sauce is so rich and packed with taste and meat and veggies. Gives the whole a, an unbelievably deep flavor. I didn't realize Law was such a food critic. Is that these veggies too, they're so meaty and tasty, just the way they are, just make really, that's so fucking good. Oh, this is bad. Real bad. Why is it bad? Wait, what? Why did you say that, Law? Whoever came up with this, what? That was a weird sound clip to play. I think it, that's odd. Uh, I can see why the palace would serve it. You know, Godeno, uh, you can make a page out of, you can take a look, you can make a page. You can take a page out of Law's book when it comes to actually explaining how something tastes. He did a very good job. Ah! ah, you people don't understand anything. All that boy does is flap his jaws. Listen, you uncultured oaf. Flavor is something you express with your whole body, not your... No, your very soul. Were you watching that? Did you see how I moved? With every fiber of my being. Open your eyes wide and burn this next sight into your brain. Oh god, here we go. Just great. <laughs> I, was, I was wrong. No need to get all worked up about it. Oh, he properly did as well. He's out of breath. Yes. Yes. Putting that aside, my palate and stomach are completely and utterly satisfied. I can now leave this room with no regrets. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> Beef stew recipe. Very nice. What a character. Man, that was amazing. No wonder the old man was so gung-ho about it. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? Shion, you've got sauce on your face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, amazing. I love it. Howdy, guys. Also, it looks even... I think it looks even prettier at night time. Look at all the lights. We're to orders to keep this gate sealed. Not like there's much to see before you reach the next realm over anyway. Just a little pond. Let's render the arms yada 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 yada. Fireflies and shit. This is this, yeah. I mean, what a place! What a place! All right, so I think we'll probably, you know, what we'll quickly explore this little area before we go up to the palace. I'm telling you, ma'am, we don't deal in that. Don't you have any room in my uh, to to be, don't you have any room to bend here? I need it. I need it for my newborn grandchild. I really wish I could help, but I can't. Could you ask around at other stores? I have no idea what she's on about. Oh, a quieter part of town and a skit. The Earth Lord. So, do any of you know anything about Lord Dohalim? I think I remember hearing something back in Cislodan about how he fights using a rod. A rod? I don't know the details, but from what I gather, he swings a long rod around and uses it to stab and smack people from afar. I think there's also something he does with, like, trees or grass or something? I forget. Grass? Bear in mind that Elder Menencia harvests Earth astral energy. It would be no surprise for him to have some sort of control over plants. So basically, the point is, we know nothing about the guy. <laughs> Wish we weren't going in completely blind. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure we'll figure it out. I'm not too worried. Although, a, a big, fighting with a big rod. Hmm. Oh crap, we can't go this way? I've been given orders not to let anyone through here for the time being. Come back later and it might be opening. Oh, okay. All right, then. I suppose we're going to the palace after all. <laughs> Gotta get these flowers to grow nice and pretty for Lord Dohalim. Yeah, Something. Act now or you'll regret it. Something wrong? Oh no, I was just wondering how I might approach the- Oh, he's got the hearts for the lady. What? Don't approach me out of nowhere, you mere Danon. Oh, that's a good point. What happens if a Renan and a Danon get it on? Eh? 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 Just go for it, dude. Just go for it. Act now or you'll regret it. Life's short. I guess I could just 
walk right up to her now. Wait, who are you? Be gone with you, suspicious lout. <laughs> that look, you truly from another realm. Uh, oh, you don't agree with his lordship, do you not? Well, it's a good job you're not in charge then, isn't it? That is a very nice water feature. Look at that. That is actually really pretty. Those water effects are making me feel things. Kind of like the way the Royal Guards look. Are, there, are these Danons or are they Renans as well? I have the honorable duty of guarding Lord Dohalim. Good. Good for you, pal. I guess we can take this? Well, I'll, I'll give you a good hint there, Lord. We just did. We just did. And no one saw it. So it's fine. Remember, guys. If you don't get caught, you didn't do anything wrong. That's not... I, I'm joking, obviously. Uh, Department for Welfare Agent. Oh, yeah. Just passing through, actually. You're a traveler? Don't see many of those. It's a dangerous world out there. Most people who try to flee and end up uh, end up attacked by Zoogles. City has both security and lodgings are plenty. Take your time and enjoy your stay. So, yeah, to be honest, I don't think I would want to leave if I lived here. It's, uh, it's pretty chill. It's pretty chill. At least, again, on the surface it is. Uh, if you want to live in the city, apply with the uh, citizen citizenry affairs official over there. She looks in. She looks like she's already wearing the giggle glasses. Curious about what I'm wearing? Not really. No, it looks pretty normal to me. I bought this myself, if you believe it. Nowadays, we Danans get paid a fair wage for the work we do. It's all thanks to Lord Doelim. Yeah, it's too good to be true. This is way too good to be true. Uh, I'll pass here's the training grounds. Uh, okay, yeah, you know what, actually? Let's go do it. Let's go check out the training grounds. A former arena with the grounds of, uh, or ten... Okay. Well, that was an easy quest. This looks cool. I actually thought it'd be like an outdoors arena. Do they actually fight in here? Or is this just the... The, the foyer? Oh, dude, if, if this is a proper so monster... The, training grounds. the atmosphere here feels different compared to the rest of Vicent. It's just a nicer name for a place where people go to fight. So? It's still a good way for us to test our strength. Stop sweating the small stuff. Huh. You look a bit nervous, mate. Okay, this time I'm gonna give it everything I have. I've been training for this day. I know I can do it. Uh, yeah, if this is like a full-on battle arena side quest with like ranks and stuff, I'm gonna be so happy. I really hope it is. We guardsmen have been underground... Uh, und I can't read today. I never can read. Undergoing rigorous training ever since we entered the guard, dedicating ourselves to one goal. Ultimate might. Test your might. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, not one inch will be given to any rotten zoogles that dare to cross me. Just cut them down and toss them aside. Cut them down. And yeah. Uh, <laughs> he's been yelling that stuff for a while now, but I haven't seen him actually step up to the reception this entire time. Uh, he's all talk. He's all talk. Ooh! They play chess in this world. I suck at chess. You know, it takes a special kind of stupid to walk up to one of us armored soldiers, pull out your weapon and try to fight us with it. Dude, if if that guy had tried that in any other realm, he'd be... He'd be dead. He'd be very dead. <laughs> what are you, five? Are you like this with everything you see? Think about what you're doing before it gets you arrested. Yeah, these Renans have way more patience. Hello. Welcome to the training grounds, the pride of Vicent. If you're looking for a place to take your training to the next level, you've come to the right place. It's very smoky in here, by the way. Uh, we embrace anybody who walks through our doors. As long as you want to improve yourself, you'll always have a place to train here. I can already tell just from looking at you all that you don't want to simply improve either. 
You want to be the best at what you do, am I right? I want to be the the, the best, the very best. Uh, the, 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 you know, that the anyone ever was, kind of thing. You know what I mean? I'm paraphrasing, but you get the gist. Uh, the ste uh, step right up. Oh my god. Single battles, group battles, dude. Oh, ha, 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 ha. We're going to go for a solo battle with Alfin. Oh, there are different. Oh my god. There's different rewards. There's going to be different rules. Damage inflicted only after downing an enemy. Oh, this is going to be fun. Recommended level. Oh my god. Recommended level 40. Recommended level 25. I don't think I'm going to even be able to tackle the novice one. I mean, I might be able to do the train. Yeah, you know what? We'll try the training one. We'll get a lemon gel for it and some sage. If we do the, if we get it within the time limit, that is. Um, we'll give it a try. So I just gotta, gotta down him somehow. Like that, I suppose. Wasn't down for very long, though. Yes! Oh, you're sucking, dude. You're sucking. Oh, I love that so much. Oh, so I think once you've downed him, you can just keep on wailing on him. Whoa! Don't know how he dodged me then. This is a cool arena, by the way. Ah, oh, stupid. I, why did I? Why did I do that? Ouch! That that hurt a little bit. Whoops. Oh, what? Oh, I thought there was only going to be one. Oh, are you kidding me? I have to do two? I mean, three, basically? Oh, shit. And they've got flamethrowers, they've got earth attacks. That's. I'm not going to do this in three minutes. I might not even do this at all. Oh, how did he miss me? Wow. God damn it. Today. Right, okay, at least we we downed them, so now we can hurt them properly. I'm gonna probably gonna die here. This is gonna be tough. Ooh. Okay, let's get some Mystic Arts on the go. Here we go. That's what I was trying to do. That's what I'm talking about. Still didn't kill them both, though, did it? Oh, in fact, they were both still alive. Crap. That's going to be tough. Your opponent is never your greatest threat. It's pride and complacency. Yeah, I actually thought that would be a lot easier. But um, I'm excited now because I have stuff to aim for. I can, like... Oh. Should we try a group battle? Let's try a group battle. Novice level... Oh, level 30, though. Small cash prize. We'll get some silver dog tags. Oh, and I can't redo this one for 60 minutes, so this will be a good way of, I suppose, grinding for money. Or they kind of make it so you can't really do that. Okay, we'll give it a try. I love this. Oh, there's a re- Oh, God. Uh, that's not cool. Should I... Focus on those things first. Oh my gosh. Alright, it's one down. It's one down. Oh, that dodge though. You know what? Ooh, strike. I was just about to swap to law, but okay, that works. Oh, it's got a shield around it. Oh, not anymore. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. Something more boomy. I can't remember what those are called. Ooh. I think that's... Uh, I think that, that means Law's going to use his Mr. Cart in a minute. Probably. I would like him to, actually. That'd be cool. It takes a true marksman. Good God, this is crazy. Oh my God. Two of them? I have to fight two of them? And balls as well? Christ! Shion, heal yourself, for the love of God. Ouch. Oh, that's that smarted. That wasn't good. Oh, God. Oh, she's using the AoE heal. Very nice. Did you just heal me? Yes. I need you, remember? Right. That's cool. I forgot we learned that. Also, we really need to get the the uh, the cores, don't we? All right, let's uh, target your weak point, sir. Come on, smash that core. Core blimey and all that. One law gets stuck in. Oh, we got a strike. There we go. Let's swap to law for a little bit. He is actually really fun to use. And I think we're done. Oh, nice. We did it. That was great. I was so happy to see you win. I accidentally flattened... I accidentally flattened my chair. Okay. So not every day you see such immense refined talent on display. Trust me. That was my first victory. Yeah. Well, to celebrate your immense strength, I offer you the special prize. Use it to motivate you to attain even greater heights than before. And uh, some silver dog tags. So we, we can't do that for another 60, 60 minutes. And the novice one is level 30. So there's not much chance we're going to do that. But we would get some, uh, some different colored skins for our armor by the looks of things. And an elixir if we do it in three minutes. Okay. Oh, I'm loving this. I will be back. Ooh, and we get a title for Xion, the sniper. Counter edge upon enemy defeat. Ah. Increased mid air damage, mid air evasion. Increased boost gauge from enemy downs. Heart uh, gauge restored from enemy, enemy defeat. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Oh, I'm, lo I'm, lo I'm loving this. I'm, I'm, I'm loving it, loving it, loving it. This game is great. And my livestock has reached maturity. So, uh, yeah, what I'm going to do is... Hmm, I'm kind of I am kind of tempted to do that side quest, though. I probably won't take too long. Or should we just go to the... Should we just go to the palace? Huh. Huh. And oh, there's always a risk, though, if I'm going outside and fighting the Zoogles, that that dragon's going to turn up again. I don't know if I can handle that. Hmm. Oh, I love I love the fact that there's freaking combat arena. We're gonna we're gonna try and do as all of that if we can, but we we need we need to be stronger. Also, maybe have a slightly different setup. Uh, frankly, I was skeptical about coexisting with Danans, but you get used to them. We're not too bad. We're not. We're not bad. Hello. Isn't this city so beautifully verdant? Uh, verdant. 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 Is it verdant or verdant? I. I don't know. The climate is nice, but it's important that we take good care of this place. Yeah. 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 
Yep, yep, yep. Hmm, how is this meeting gonna go? Because, I mean, <laughs> we can't just say, yeah, by the way, we want to murder you. He was a talkative chap. Look at the view from here, though, as well. And the fact that it's built on top of a forest is just kind of cool. Uh, this is all Tolina Palace, the Manor of Dohlim. Yep. Entry is forbidden to all but those with his lordship's express permission. Oh, okay. Oh, wait. Did I need to... I needed to go back and talk to the guy near the entrance, didn't I? That's what I need to do. So, you know what, actually? Since we've got a little bit of time to kill, because I don't really want to be recording for too long tonight, we're going to go do that side quest. We're going to go kill some... Uh, some whatever they are. The earth things. Oh, did I never talk to you? I never talked to this guy. Your armor rocks, big guy. Let me wear it. Do you really think you can wear that, Dan and boy? You're an idiot. <laughs> Our armor is certainly something even a Dan and like you could wear. Oh, is it? You just need to grow it? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> obviously. I'll work hard to grow big and strong then, promise. God, oh, yes. Yeah, some of these Renans are actually I like. I believe I'm seeing Danins and Renans getting along. Me neither. You never know. It could all be an act on orders from the Renans. To what end? It would be an incredible amount of effort just to fool us. Let's check out more of the city. There's probably places we haven't seen yet. Well, yeah, I'm gonna have to go chat to that other guy. Uh, it would. It. Yeah, I don't see why you would put on such a big act. I, d I don't know. I can't wait to learn more about this Lord guy, because he, okay. he's very Off different. We go. Right. So, we'll go kill these things, and then that'll probably be a video. Uh, I may have missed uh, an area around here. I think someone in the comments said I missed a, a cave in the water or something. I thought I, I definitely went in that one though, didn't I? Might as well grab the, the fish. Yeah, I definitely. Yeah, I went in there. I got Is that the item. Sword okay? A little water's not going to hurt it. <sighs> so, I don't think I missed anything. I could have done. Fleetfoot crystal. Ooh, have we had one of those before? Might be. A, I think that's probably going to be a speed accessory thing, isn't it? This is the only water in the area. Unless I'm thinking of a different... I'm pretty sure I've explored everywhere. I don't know if I've missed a cave. Oh, there's one! There it is. There it is. <sighs> ah, it's just some sage. Okay, that's cool though. Still not going to use any of those yet. Right, let's go... Uh, let's go murder some some enemies for that guy. Oh no, that's the... What did you want again? Oh, you... I think you're the... You're the big Zoogle guy, aren't you? I can't remember. Oh wait, no, he's he's the guy... Yeah, he's the guy we're doing the side quest for. We, we want to kill the things that are causing his tools to rust. That's what it was. How bad is my memory? That was literally at the beginning of this video. Wow. Right, so we want to fight. All we have to do is get rid of that thing, right? These things. Pretty sure we just want to fight these things. Earthen right, masses, yes. There we go. So yeah, I mean, we we probably could <laughs> probably don't need to show this. But let me know, chaps, if there's any more quests like this where it's just like, go kill these enemies that you've killed a million times before. Um, let me know. Will you stop having that- Oh, shit. Strike! Let me know. If you, if you want to see more kind of mundane side quests, 
or should I just do them off screen? This could be useful. Uh, okay. I just need to kill four more of them. It shouldn't be too bad, Is although there's the only two here. For? Go only no two. further. Pretty sure we got to kill eight. Also, I like, um, thanks for letting me know which characters you enjoy using so far, chat. It's obviously no spoilers for characters we haven't got yet. Uh, but it's interesting how a lot of people seem to like Alfin. Which I can absolutely understand because he is very fun to use. And apparently there's a couple of, uh, fun characters coming up very soon. So, very, very excited. Let's go kill these guys and then we're done. Oh, I don't want to fight boars as well. I don't want to fight boars as well. Alright. You know what, let's focus on the same one. Yeah, going through those apple gels. I might, I might remove that from my uh, strategy, I'm not sure yet. Oh, there he goes. Absolutely kicking the shit out of that pig. That was pretty cool. And that healing AoE, I love it. I think I just got a counter dodge there or whatever it was. Couldn't really see there was that much going on. <laughs> I need to remember what, what Art's Law has. Talent Storm. I mean, I've not really messed around with his setup yet. I'm going to get rid of Steel. I don't really want to use that, especially since it uses CP. Might save that for like a boss fight or something. Let's get Whirlwind Snap on the go. And Glimmer Dragon. Ooh. Oh, that's cool. Hey, that's cool. Ooh, I like that as well. Hey, that's cool. Look at us. We're all, we're all like... Oh, so... Oh, I just, I just fucking love this game. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I love this game. It's so fun. We're in good form. Oh, we just got a bunch of items as well. Ooh, Earthstone 4. Yeah, that's good quality. That's good quality. And we didn't get attacked by the dragon, which is nice. So we just got five lemons. And I think uh, we should be good to go back and hand in that quest now, can't we? Uh... Oh, defeat eight earthen mass near the field. They have to be specific ones. Like the oh. Zulu we were told about. Oh well, we'll go do that now then. These aren't earthen masses. What? This is this isn't right. This won't this won't count towards the thing, will it? Oh, there we go. That dodge though. Oh fuck! <laughs> Shit! I knew it! I knew he was gonna turn up! We are kinda doomed. Sorry, right. I'm calm. Oh, we downed him. Holy shit, we downed him. We're not gonna be able to kill him though. If we take if we take any damage from him. How do we run? How do we run away? How do I flee? I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run. Uh, how do I? Oh, there we go. We did it. All right. That's the, I think that's the first time we've ran away. So I wasn't really sure how to do it. Ah. Oh. But those are the Zoogles I need to kill, apparently. Or is it these ones? We'll just kill these ones because it says Earthen Masses, so... No backing 
Ouch. That stings. Ouch. There we go. Get that strike in. That training is paying off. Although we really do need to get more more powerful if we're going to be doing that training arena. Wash. Right, is that is that good? Wow, that was a nice move there. I know, right? Bet you couldn't do it. So it's a grab here, thrust the left leg, <laughs> then use the right arm to leverage over. Stop memorizing my move. That's amazing. Um, maybe they only appear at a certain time of day. They're definitely not around here, and I did have to run from the boars. It says earth and masses. Yeah, okay, I'm really not quite sure when these things are going to spawn. Maybe we just have to come back. Hey, didn't we find a recipe that... Yeah, we can use What I might do is just end it here, and I'll find them and kill them off screen. And then I'll, uh, I'll hand in the quest next time. So, thank you for watching. Hope you're enjoying it. I'm still absolutely in love with this game, as you can tell. And uh, I will hopefully get around to recording this again very soon. Oh, the sun's rising. It's the tale of a rise. Is that why they call it that? Probably not. Uh, but yeah, see you in the next one, chaps. <laughs> Take care. Bye bye for now.